I'd like to take a moment to respond to Michael Pearl's statement about the vocal few who are decrying his child training methods. He is right. We are a vocal few. But here's what I know. Sometimes the voice of one crying out in the wilderness is far louder than the support of supposed millions. Sometimes all it takes is a vocal few to alert the broader Christian community. Michael Pearl also calls us caustic. Does he mean caustic like him calling us foolish and uninformed is caustic? <laughs> because I think the way he means caustic is to say, I'm calling you caustic as an attempt to invalidate the evidence you have against me. But here's the problem. The only evidence we have are his own words, which is why it's interesting that he calls us uninformed. We're not uninformed, at least not in my case. I read the books. I subscribed to their newsletter. I read their website for years. I even attended meetings to discuss his books. It's precisely because I am informed that I'm willing to speak out. I know from firsthand experience how easily Michael Pearl's methods can become abusive. I also know unequivocally that God's method of child training does not include the use of a quarter inch length of plumbing supply line ever. So Michael Pearl and his supporters can call me a gossiper, a slanderer, foolish, uninformed, godless. That's okay. Because there are two dead children who can no longer speak for themselves. For their sake, and for the sake of many others, we, the vocal few, will continue to speak out. No more dead kids.